MTP Flyers here with another five minutes in the penalty box. This is pretty special tonight. I wanted to get this out as soon as possible. I have been on Twitter tonight, so anybody on Twitter that's following me on there, you kind of have an idea what this is. Sort of. I gave you half of it. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and show you guys what I picked up. I'm going to go ahead and take this off camera for a second here. The first one is dun, 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 the new shuffle. I just had to get this, man. This thing just looked too sweet. Absolutely awesome. Picked it up at Apple Store over in King of Prussia. Thank you guys very much. Guy Mike there helped me out. We were talking for a few minutes. He actually gave me some tips on it. So we're going to open this up. I'm going to let you guys know what's going on. We'll take a look at it and see what we got here. Hey guys, sorry about that. This is so small that I can actually put my tripod down to the lowest it can go to get this in frame. So this is actually awesome. As a matter of fact, there we go. Shuffle Baby, you are tiny. Look at that. 4 gig. Pretty sweet. Mike also did tell me that you have to use these headphones. I'll try it out. See what we can't do. But as of right now, these are the only headphones that will work with this. They do sell an adapter. It may not work. They have not tried it yet. I should have picked it up to try it. This is just cool. Look at that. There's the headphones right there. I believe... Yeah, that's actually taped on the back right there. So we'll just go ahead and set that up right there real quick. These are the headphones, baby. I wonder if the 3G headphones will work with this, the came with the iPhone. I don't know. This is the one thing that I kind of got bummed out when I was talking to Mike about. This is it. You plug this into the headphone jack and you plug it into your computer port. So, <laughs> not much room to move around. Back to this unboxing. Along with your port to dock it, as far as charging it, you come with your directions. And I can only imagine explains to you exactly what this guy does here. So, turn off, turn on, play in order, shuffle. So actually what it does is to the to the left will be to turn it off. The center will be to uh, play just in order that you put them on there, that, that they are in there. And then all the way to the right will be to shuffle. There's your headphone jack, and we'll have to take a look and see exactly what that is. That is actually your status light. And of course you have your standard headphones that everybody's used to. Volume up, volume down, the plus and minus. Play, pause, is single click. Go to next track, double click. Go to the previous track, triple click. And to hear your current song name, click and hold the center button. That's cool. To change playlist, click and hold center button and release after you hear a tone. When you hear the playlist you want, click to select it. Very cool. Very cool. I just had to plug it in there. It'll tell you. I apologize. The light's a little messed up down here. I'm not doing this downstairs. Battery charge will be green. Battery charging will be a solid orange. And a light blinking means do not disconnect. So battery full, 75%, 50%. Battery status when disconnected, flick the switch off to see the status light to hear spoken battery status. Oh, cool, it'll tell you when it's at full 75 and 50. It'll tell you when it's at 25 and low battery. If your shuffle stops responding, you'll see a solid red light to connect to iTunes to restore. For complete instructions, and important safety information, see iPod Shuffle User Guide at apple.com backslash support, access manuals, backslash iPod. Very cool. Very cool. Listen responsibly. This is just badass. I believe we just do our clip. Ooh, that is a strong clip. Carlos, you weren't kidding, buddy. That is a strong clip. Wow. That's beautiful. That is just beautiful. Beautiful, look at that. You mirror finish, you can see right through there. 
Hi. Hmm. That's simple, guys. That's simple. That's all we got. Very, very cool. We are in the overtime, guys. Sorry about that. This is going to be my 10 minutes in the penalty box if I don't if I don't start speeding this up a little bit. I'm going to have a full review on this probably this weekend. Try this out. And we will give you the verdict. I heard the the voice on it's a little a little weird. I did see something on the internet when they were trying it out. The voice is like a robot voice. So, you know, that's still a cool idea. Absolutely cool. So, guys, that's that. And last but not certainly not least is the other item that I purchased while I was in the store. And the only person that knows right now is Mike, the guy at the store. So, I can't wait to try that out. That's going to be awesome. One last. So we'll just call this a 10-minute misconduct for anybody that watches hockey. I got a 10-minute misconduct. I'll get a 10-minute misconduct if my wife finds out that I bought this stuff. <laughs> just kidding. All right, you ready? Yeah, I had to buy it. <laughs> the iPod Nano. I got the green, man. Had to get the green. I, I know orange is my favorite color. Most of you guys out there know that. But I had to get the green. Honestly, I've only played with these at the store a little bit. And it didn't, didn't seem half bad. It didn't seem anything special than what we're used to. So here's your iPod Nano instructions. And then, of course, you guys know that inside you have another set of headphones. You have your dock for any radio that you may have. Put that right to the side there. And then your USB, which I can use another one of these. That's actually pretty cool. So that is it for that. And then, of course, we have the Nano which is just a sweet color. Again, props to Mike for suggesting this color. Absolutely awesome. There's the little apple. Very cool. Yes. Yeah, the things that that amuse me. It's all good. Very, very nice loading up there. I love that green. That's just really cool. That'll look cool in some of the uh, clear cases I'm going to be trying out. If anybody asks, oh, you already got an iPhone, why'd you get this? I want to do this for reviews, for the cases and stuff like that. I just, I love the way these look. I love the way the cases look. I have been dying to try this out. So, I'm going to load some stuff onto it tonight and give it a try and have another full review for you guys on this, probably this weekend. So, look at that. We got Klondike, Maze, and Vortex. That'll be some cool games to try out. So, all right, guys. Well, listen, I'm going to have to edit this down. Try to get it down a little bit. Add my stuff onto it. Thank you, Mike, at the Apple Store. Very cool. Thanks for all your help. I greatly appreciate it. And full reviews coming up on the Nano 4G. That's it for my 5 and 5 minutes in the penalty box. For my 10 minute misconduct. You guys have a good evening. This is MTP Fire signing out. See ya.